study a lot in my time at UMKC and I've really fallen in love with his music. Uh, so as I thought about what I wanted to play on this recital, I couldn't imagine not playing the music of Wayne Shorter. I'm going to invite to the stage now Henry Scamura on 
alto saxophone. Uh, let's give him a hand. And we're going to continue with some of my original music. This first tune uh, that we've got for you is called The Speak. There in Oklahoma City is a venue called the 51st Street Speakeasy. Uh, and every Wednesday night for the last several years, they've had live jazz, and jam sessions, and that kind of thing. And it's just a really great uh, community, really great.
if you don't know the music of J.J. Johnson, he was really the first person to play bebop on the trombone. Um, the trombone was, was kind of left out at the, the very first part of that new revolution in jazz music, uh, but he came along and found a way to play really, really fast lines with all the saxophonists and trumpet players and everybody. Um, and so all that to say, I, I wouldn't be here without his music um, because he really has had such a tremendous impact on me and on every trombone player um, in the jazz music community. So we're going to play a tune that he wrote. Um, this one is called J. Thank you. 
Chris Bradley, Ty McCormick, and Landon Schmidt on their way out here. Um, and we're going to do an arrangement of a tune by another one of my favorite musicians, uh, somebody named Pat Matheny, a guitar player who is from Kansas City. Um, and this tune is, is the title track from his 2020 record, From This Place. Um, and I, I love this record so much, it's one of my personal favorites, and the tune on it gorgeous tune originally written for vocalists and guitar and rhythm section, um, but when I heard it, I, I imagined it for trombone, and so I'm really grateful for these guys for bringing it to life, so we're going to play our arrangement of it now, which is From This Place.
continue now with another original. Um, this next one is a tune that I wrote for my wife, Amy. Uh, she is watching on the live stream today because she had just started a gig with the Air Force Regional Dance, and I'm super excited to go join her um, doing that in just a short time. Uh, this tune, the name of it comes from some advice that I was given. I was told uh, to write down a list of all the things that you want in a partner, and that way when you meet them,
welcome Henry Skimmer out uh, once again on Apple Sax. And we're going to play a tune that might be familiar to you, um, but you probably haven't heard it quite like this. This is an old hymn that I grew up singing and is near and dear to my heart. Uh, this one is called I Need Thee Every Hour. Once again, how about a hand for these guys who are learning my music, Henry Skimmer out on Apple Sax.
tune, I just want to say some quick thank yous. Thank you once again to the band, Isaiah, Matt, Sebastian, and Henry, uh, for learning my music and just being such a, such a great group to work with and play with. Let's give them a hand one last time. I also want to thank the big band for giving up their afternoon and uh, bringing this last composition to life for me. It's been a treat to get to hear them. last tune is one that I wrote several years ago and have played many times with uh, different small groups over the years, uh, but this is the first time that I've ever gotten to play it with a big band. And so I've, I've been working with Professor Lewis all semester on big band arranging and learning kind of the tricks of the trade because he's a master at it. Um, and so this is a final product and I'm really excited to share this with you all. This is Transcription.
around and say hello, let me thank you for being here.